Hi everybody, I'm Sergio with Mobility Direct and welcome to our YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping by. In today's video, we're going to give you a comparison of the top five most popular folding power wheelchairs of 2023. Now before we get started with this video, like always, I just want to mention two quick things. Number one, if you want a copy of our brand new product catalog, just go to our website www.mobilitydirect.com. Click on the green button at the top of every page that says free catalog. Fill out the simple short form and you'll get one in the mail within one to two weeks tops. I also want to say that if you subscribe to our YouTube channel, you're automatically entered into our monthly giveaway raffle. We give away a free powered mobility product once a month to a random subscriber of our YouTube channel. It's free, it takes no time. You're already here, so what are you waiting for? If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and you could be the next lucky winner like the past few winners that we just threw on the screen. With that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Now, I'm gonna review these top five folding power wheelchairs in no particular order. I'm gonna start all the way to your right, my left, with a product called the Cricket by Golden Technologies. The Cricket is going to be best known for its mesh back seat, which if you live in a hot state, this can be a game changer. It's really breathable, it's super comfy, and again, if you're in a hot state, you're not gonna sweat too much, that is a definite unique feature and the fact that no other chair is going to have the weight capacity of 300 pounds while still weighing less than 35 pounds with the battery pack and the parts removed. So when you break this thing down, take the joystick and the battery pack out, it only weighs 33.2 pounds. It's super easy to fold up. It has a top speed of 3.7 miles per hour and a turning radius of 22 inches. The dimensions are 36.6 inches by 22.25 inches wide. So it's really compact. Just gonna bring it out here for you and show you how it folds. The Cricut also has a storage pouch underneath the seat, which you can use to put your charger in. All of these power chairs have similar chargers. You've got a wall outlet plug and a three-prong barrel connector. You can plug this three-prong barrel connector known as an XLR charger right into the joystick or into the battery pack itself. So there's the joystick uh, charging ports and you also have a USB charging port on the Cricut as well to charge your USB powered devices. Now the seat on this bad boy is not too big. It's about 17, just over 17 inches wide by 16 and a half inches deep, but it is a very compact chair, so it's not gonna be as big as far as the seat compared to some of the other models. Now to fold it, there's a little latch in the back. Just hold that up. You wanna flip up the foot plate first, actually. So flip up the foot plate, hold that latch, bring the backrest forward. The whole thing just collapses on itself. And even with the battery and joystick on it, it's super duper lightweight. Now this is model number GP. 302 and it's made by Golden Technologies. We have an in-depth review video, so if you wanna learn more about this one, check out our YouTube video review of this product. We go into the nitty gritty details, but again, what makes this one unique is the weight capacity. 300 pounds, it's about 33 pounds all up with the joystick and the battery removed. Super lightweight, carbon fiber frame. It doesn't have suspension, but it's very, very comfortable. It's not really meant for going off-road, mainly for indoor use and flat surfaces. 
Again, check out the link in our description to learn more about this awesome product. All right, so the next chair that we're gonna review is also made by Golden Technologies. By the way, Golden Technologies is one of the most well-known and trusted name brands in the industry when it comes to manufacturing powered mobility products. They include an industry-leading warranty and a one-year service agreement to cover labor if you do have a warranty claim that is approved within the first year. It's pretty awesome. We love recommending their products. They have parts always available. If you need parts, you can call our parts department. We get them out quickly. And Golden is very quick to process warranty claims. Now the Stride is model GP301. And what makes this one unique is that it has bigger tires that can handle going on grass better than probably any other model. We've tested all of these on grass. This one performs really well on grass and it has full suspension. It's also gonna have one of the widest seats with the thickest cushion. So if you're gonna be spending a lot of time on this chair, you'll probably find that this one is gonna be one of the more comfortable options and it has a seat back that's a bit taller than the rest of them as well. Well, most of them, I should say. So the seat back height is there. The width and the depth is also gonna be bigger. You could tell by the size of that cushion that it's a pretty comfortable seat. The seat back height is 16 inches. The width of the seat is 17 inches and the depth is 18 inches. Now, the Stride has a weight capacity of 265 pounds. With the parts removed, it's gonna weigh just over 50 pounds. The speed is 3.7 miles per hour. The turning radius is 23.6 inches with a dimension of 42 and a half inches long by 24.4 inches wide. Now, this is one of the only ones that's not gonna have the Micon electronic controller and joystick. It's got a bigger full-size VSI controller. And I'm gonna show you a few things of how it works, but again, if you wanna really see in-depth details, go over all the specs and see a full review video of this, check out our YouTube channel. We have a really nice in-depth review video of this product. Now the battery pack on this model and the one we just looked at before, it's the same exact battery pack. It's very lightweight. You can take it out and charge the battery on or off the power wheelchair. So again, for this model and the one we just reviewed, which is the Cricut, you've got the same battery. You can remove it and fold the chair the same way. You have that latch in the back, nice suspension coils here in the back that you can see. Once you lift that up, you wanna make sure your foot plate is folded up. Use the latch, collapse the backrest down, and there you have it, it's folded up. And it's got a real small dimension, small footprint. You can fit it in the trunk of the car, just like the Cricut, only this is a little bit bigger and it's made with aluminum, whereas the Cricut is made with carbon fiber. That's the main difference here. So I'm gonna unfold it. By the way, both the models that we just reviewed, in fact, all the models that we're reviewing today have flip up armrests. They all come with seat belts as well. And one other thing that they all have is a USB charging port on the joystick controller. So you can charge the battery on the charging port that's on the battery or on the joystick, and you can use the USB powered port there to charge your cell phone or other USB powered devices. What's nice about the Stride, just like the Cricut, it has a storage pouch underneath the seat. You also have a little storage pouch on the back of the seat as well. All right, so the next power wheelchair that we're gonna review is made by Pride Mobility, probably the most well-known brand in the industry. This is called the Jazzy Carbon. Now, Pride Mobility has been making Jazzy power chairs for decades. They are some of the most well-known power chairs, the most dependable ones out there. This is unique because it has a carbon fiber frame, just like the Cricut, full suspension, very, very lightweight, the carbon can hold up to 300 pounds and it weighs 39.6 pounds with the battery pack removed. It has a 3.7 mile per hour top speed, a 9.3 mile range. Just like most of the other chairs in this video, they all go about the same distance, which is about 9.3 miles. In fact, every chair we've reviewed so far does about 9.3 miles on a full charge with a top speed of 3.7 miles per hour, which is just above 
a fast walking speed. You're not running to keep up with it, you're walking quickly. Now again, aside from the suspension, you've got the flip up armrests, the carbon fiber frame. This is one of the only models that we actually offer in two different colors. You can get it in white. Aside from the carbon fiber parts, this, this part of the frame, which is an aluminum, is powder coated white. You can get it in black. And again, flip up armrests. The tires aren't too big. It doesn't really perform extremely well on grass for long periods of time, but you can traverse over grass for short periods of time. Same joystick controller as the Cricket, so you've got the USB uh, charging port and the charging ports on the battery as well as the joystick. Now, as you can see, it has the Myco Electronics controller back here, which is super easy to service. If you're a technician, you should be able to get this in and out pretty quickly. Nice suspension coils on the back. And on this model, you can actually adjust how stiff or how firm the backrest is by adjusting the tightness of these straps. So if you want to sink back more into the seat, you loosen these straps up and that's how you adjust the firmness of the backrest. Now, it does have a storage pouch in the back to put some of your belongings in as well as one underneath the seat. So you've got a storage pouch there and a storage back, uh, pouch in the back of the seat. Here's the joystick controller charging port for the XLR charger and the USB charging port to charge your electronic devices. It's got a nice seat. The seat dimensions are 17 inches wide by 17 inches deep. You can upgrade the seat cushion on this to a really nice thick stealth, uh, it's called a stealth upgraded seat cushion, which we'll show you on the screen for just a second. Comes with the seat belt. Now to fold this power wheelchair, just like the other ones, you want to take the battery pack out, almost an identical battery pack with a charging port there. Flip up the foot plate, grab the latch in the back, unhook it, push down. Look at that, super lightweight, very, very lightweight. And I personally think this is the best looking folding power wheelchair on the market right now. I love the powder coated white finish with the carbon fiber and the red suspension coil. It gives it a nice sporty look. Now again, if you wanna learn more about the Jazzy Carbon by Pride Mobility, check out the in-depth review video. Pride also includes a one-year service agreement with the purchase of any powered mobility product. So if you do have a warranty claim within the first year, a technician will be dispatched to your home to replace the parts that are needed under a warranty claim. All right, next on the list, we have a Journey Health product. That's the brand. The model is called the Air. It's a folding power wheelchair, and it's very, very comparable to the other models, but this one is gonna weigh uh, 37.4 pounds, and it has a weight capacity of 240 pounds. Now, what makes this model a little bit different is it does have suspension, so it's gonna have a smooth ride, but aside from that, it does have two single foot plates. I'm gonna bring it out, and I'm gonna show you something, too. So we're gonna give you a little walk around. It has real big tires on it, probably one of the bigger tires, and it's gonna perform really well on grass compared to the others, not for full-time use on grass, depending on the load. If you have a lighter load on it, it'll do better on grass compared to if you're really close to the maximum weight capacity. So I'll go over a few of the specs, 240 pound weight capacity again, 2.8 mile speed, so definitely gonna be slower than the rest. It has a 10 mile range, a 35.4 inch turning radius, and the dimensions are 36.2 inches in length by 22 inches wide. Now, this is going to have a Micon electronic controller and joystick, just like most of the other ones we looked at, and I'm gonna show you how it folds. This chair is gonna fold like a manual wheelchair. It has the flip up armrests, has the USB charging port and the joystick uh, charging port for the charger as well. But when you're getting ready to fold it, instead of folding the backrest forward, you actually just pick up here and there you go. You can remove the foot plates, which are individual foot plates. Instead of having one foot plate, you've got one for each foot. You can remove these rings that are just like little clips, take the foot plates out, and now you can easily put this in the trunk of the car or your SUV or van. It's pretty lightweight. You can also use the clips right here to fold the two hand rests back. And it's gonna take a really compact shape. So that's pretty much 
how you fold it. You'll also notice it has a battery pack on the side, which is removable and it has the charging port right there, the as well as a little charge, as well as a little charge indicator button to show you the charging state of the battery. To remove it, press that button at the top and it slides right out. It's that simple. This is a really neat power wheelchair and we have it for sale tax-free. Shipping is free like the rest of our products as well. The only downfall is it doesn't come with a manufacturer-backed service agreement for one year. However, we do offer service agreements. They're just not going to be included for free with this product. And that about is going to wrap up the quick review of the Journey Health Air Folding Power Wheelchair. One last thing, the seat on this, the width is going to be 16.5 inches and the depth is 15.74 inches. Not bad, pretty comparable to the rest, and it does come with a seat belt. A storage pouch on the back of the backrest, not, not on the bottom side, underneath, but you do have storage on the rear. And it's a pretty big storage pouch in the back. All right, last but not least, certainly not least, we have the Journey Health air elite folding power wheelchair so made by the same company as the air the air elite is made with carbon fiber and it's by far the lightest one out of the five so it can hold 240 pounds weighs only 26 pounds which is unreal so it does fold like the air that we just went over it doesn't fold forward it folds kind of down the middle and like a manual wheelchair with a top speed of 2.8 miles per hour, a 10 mile range, a 35.4 inch turning radius with a length of 35.4 inches and a width of 22.8 inches. Now the seat on this model is 16.5 inches wide by 15.7 inches deep. So I'm going to show you how it folds. We can just like the other one, use these clips to fold back the handles on the back. Then what you want to do is pick up from the front underneath, just pull straight up, and the whole thing just folds up into a super compact shape. You can remove the foot plates if you need to the same way. You just pop out these little clips, and each of the foot plates will come out. You don't need to, but you can just to give it an even more compact shape. And let me tell you something, this is an extremely lightweight product. I can hold it out in front of me, granted I am able-bodied, but a lot of individuals get this chair particularly because of how lightweight it is. And for such a lightweight chair, I gotta say it's pretty darn comfortable. It does have a nice seat here that is not really a cushion to make it super lightweight. They do have to kind of reduce the size of everything, including the frame, the seat, but it's got a nice carbon fiber look to it, comes with a seat belt, and just like the Journey Air, got a nice storage pouch on the back, same joystick controller as most of the other ones, with that USB powered port and the charging port for the actual battery to charge. You can flip up the armrest with this red button, and just like the other Journey Air, you have the battery pack here, which you can remove by pressing this button. And what's nice is you've got a charging port and a USB, so if you want to take this with you in your carry-on, you can charge your phone with the battery pack, or you can charge the battery with the charger and an on and off switch there. Pretty nice. All right, so we went over a few of the specs for each one. Again, we have in-depth review videos for each of these. We're going to go ahead and cue in some action shots showing you what it's like to go on grass and a couple of different awesome shots. I hope you enjoy. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video review of the most popular, top five most popular folding power wheelchairs of 2023. Uh, we do have non-commissioned sales experts ready to answer your questions, so you can give us a call. Our non-commissioned sales experts are not pushy. They'd be more than happy to hear from you. We'd love to earn your business. Or if you wanna just leave a question in the comment section below, we reply to every single comment of our YouTube videos. So drop a comment, give it a thumbs up, share the video if you wanna support our YouTube channel. We really appreciate you stopping by. Again, I'm Sergio with Mobility Direct. Thanks for watching and have a great day.